are ready to put your flange bearing on. Okay, step three, you're ready to slide your bearing on your shaft. Now all you need to do is just pick up on the front. Now we're ready to bolt our bearing to our seal. Slide your seal plate up. Start your bolt. Bolts are tight, we're ready to go to the tail end and install your tail bearing. Okay, now you're ready to slide your bearing onto your shaft. We'll bring her down and bolt the bearing in place. Now what we would suggest if you will measure off the front of your bearing to the end of your shaft, eight and a quarter inches, this will leave you enough room to slide your gearbox down into place properly. Before we do that, we're going to show you what lock tight to use to tighten your set screws on your flange bearing. Now that you're ready to tighten your set screws on your flange bearing, we recommend using a 222 lock tight. This will allow you easier access to your set screws when you get ready to break them loose. Then we're ready to install our gearbox.